Welcome to Chartrix. With Chartrix add-in for PowerPoint, you can seamlessly convert the collected research data into PowerPoint reports, share them with customers, collaborate with colleagues, and automatically reproduce the existing reports with new data. In this video, we will cover how to add Chartrix add-in to your PowerPoint and how to navigate Chartrix. Let's get started. Go to the Chartrix website and download the Chartrix add-in to start your free trial. Make sure to close all your PowerPoint and Excel files. Run the setup as administrator and follow the wizard to install the app. When the installation is completed, open PowerPoint and check out the Chartrix tab on the PowerPoint toolbar. Sign up with your email and you're ready to go. Let's go over the main Chartrix modules and tools. In Chartrix, we start creating reports by uploading and organizing all the data sets and presentations in MyCloud. The step is required to create a reliable link between the PowerPoint, your analysis, and data sources. In the Chartrix cloud, all your files can be organized under the hierarchical folders named Account and Project. Once you have selected an account, you will be able to see any projects you have created in this account. A project is where you keep all the related reports and datasets. The next group of buttons is used to add charts to your report. Under the PowerPoint button, you can find all the native PowerPoint charts. At Chartrix, we have introduced new chart types designed to meet market researchers' specific needs. A table chart, a metric chart, and a rating scale chart. Chartmaker is an easy-to-use chart-making interface where you can connect your source data to the chart, drag and drop variables to create crossings, perform your analysis, and apply the result to your report. Next, we have the Chartrix Automation Tools. The repeater allows you to automatically generate hundreds of slides filtered by the selected variable categories. Under the Global Actions, you will find the Global Filter and Global Weight. You can use them to bulk apply filters or weight to your charts in any number of slides. You can use the Report Update to replace the data source and reproduce the same presentation with new data or recalculate the charts to synchronize them with your source data. And that's how you install and navigate Chartrix. We will discuss these features one by one in our future videos. If you have any question on how to get the most out of Chartrix, reach out to us at support.chartrix.com. We'll see you next time.